everybody, welcome back to another episode of my 30 Days to Die series. It is the morning of day 57, and I have done a bunch of work on the base and the horde base, uh, which I'll show you in a second. I fixed the ramp outside here. We're going to go out here in, in, what, five minutes game time. I don't want to go out right away because we've been getting a lot of screamers, and I don't want to encounter a whole bunch of, of zombies out here running. Not right now when we want to get out of here. Uh, but I'll show you the ramp. It's going to make getting back into the base a heck of a lot easier. And it's all concrete. And it's a little bit of a... Um, less of an incline as it was before. So I'm thinking... Yeah, way better. It's going to be so easy to get back in now. I mean, I should have... Um, you know what I should have done is I should have made this come out one more. So it was a flat block before getting in, but no big deal. All right, let's hit up the bike. We are going to head up north. Check out the horde base as we go by. I did remember to fuel up today. So I got everything done. The ramp is not perfect, but it is what it is. Um, I don't think we're going to have that much of an issue with the horde. As long as they take the bait for this base, uh, I think we're going to shred them pretty quick. But the ramp is in now, so all they have to do is climb up. We got our spikes down, our spikes protecting the pillars. Pretty much it. Um, didn't do much else. I threw a few candles down here just so we can see uh, the zombies. But we'll have a helmet light on. I tested the light last night. So we have, we'll be able to see everything in this tunnel. No problems at all. Alright, so we're going to head up north. We have um, a clear zombies quest we need to do. So we're going to hit up and do that first. And then um, I was watching a video from Reach Gaming. And they were saying, or he was saying, that... Um, he was listing his uh, five uh, most difficult POIs. Now, we've already done Shotgun Messiah. That was on his list. The other one was Waterworks, which we're going to hit up today. There's a couple of Waterworks in the town we're going to, so we're going to hit up one of those today and check it out. Once we clear the zombies at this rally point, which shouldn't really take too long, I don't think. Um, I got lots of ammo on me. This time I brought med kits. I did not bring a lot of wood, but I did bring frames. So we've got frames on us this time. Um, what else did I bring? Um, lots of yucca juice, painkillers, we got first aid kits, regular first aid, over a thousand rounds, bacon and eggs, we got lots of stuff. So we should, in theory, be good. The only thing I didn't bring is antibiotics. I don't think we'll need them. I haven't, we haven't really needed any. Let's see if this guy is, uh, feeling like he wants to go to space today. Nope, not today. All right. So it should just be up here. It wasn't very far into town where we got a clear, and then, um, oh wait, is it the, uh, I thought it was a house that we had to clear. Find out here in a second. Hmm. This guy's hanging out by the corner having a smoke. What's up, buddy? Just waiting for the day to start. Oh, right here. Well, that should be easy. We've done these like uh, how many times we've done these? Too many times. Let's not so for no radiated zombies. Tier one quest. Should be pretty easy. Oh, look at you. Look at you. I'm not supposed to leave the area, buddy. I gotta stay here. So come on over. Here. You're making me waste arrows, that's not nice. That's gotta hurt. Alright. That better not be it. Okay, we got a guy over here. Got a snake. Okay, I'm hearing somebody sleeping. Probably behind there. Oh. Dude, you're sleeping on the job. That's what happens. You know, I've been noticing more and more with like steel arrows and stuff. Um, it seems to be harder to get the steel arrows back. And that's it. There's nobody else in here. Well. Let's just see what's in the crates. We'll take this. Um, let's just open this sucker up. Alright, open this guy up. 
that we got here. I really shouldn't be picking anything up, but we'll throw it all in the bike. Eh. I do need eggs, though. That's one thing I want to get. We got a guy outside. Uh, and brass. So I guess the uh, fun pimps were saying that it's going to be more difficult to... Um, I hear you out there. Find um, stuff in the... Uh, in 118. Like gas and things like that. Alright, we don't need these. Dude, you seem very angry. What's up, guy? Here. Take some of that. Alright, we don't need anything in here. Let's just drop this stuff in the bike. And we're going to head over... Storage. It's a good thing we got honey, though. I should probably keep the wood on me, eh, guys? Probably not. Alright, now the waterworks is just up here. And we're right here. So it's one street over and one block up. About the bombardier. Eh. Okay, here it is. So I have no idea what to expect here. Not going to loot yet. We'll loot later on. I know I said last time we should loot as we go, but I don't want to get overloaded with junk. Maybe I should, I mean, I could, I guess I could just take ammo and stuff, but we brought so much, so I don't think we'll need it. We'll only loot if we have to. Looks like it's saying we need to go up the ladder first, and I don't see anybody on the outside. Although, I wonder if I should go around back. Maybe I should. Got to speed this up a little bit. Um, okay, looks pretty open back here. Start off with this because, yeah. So I put the rad remover on the SMG this time. Oh, get lost. <sighs> oh my god. One damn bird. Are you in here? Somebody else sleeping somewhere. Ooh, repair kits. That's the one thing I forgot to bring is repair kits. Probably good that we brought that. Or we found that, I mean. All right. Yeah, let's keep ourselves at max for this. We got lots of first aid, not worried about using it. Oh, for Christ's sake, please stop with the... Oh, that was a big boy, too. Alright, where is the way in now? Are you kidding me? Okay, so we got a broken leg. I need to find duct tape. What's up, buddy? I guess we are looting as we go. That is a horrible way to... The weird thing is, is I stepped on that. I'm like, oh shit, I gotta jump. Just as I stepped on, I'm like, I gotta jump! I 
Okay, we need duct tape. I think it's duct tape and wood. Oh, well, hello there. Uh, let's go recipes. Splint. Cloth and wood. Um, scrap that. There's the wood, right? How many wood did it say? Two? Yeah, so we got two wood. Now all we need... Man, this is bad. Already bad. All we need to do is find some uh, cloth fabric, which shouldn't be too bad, I don't think. Window blinds, furniture. Sometimes you can find it in trash, but not always. Well, we got lots of duct tape. Okay, there's a guy over there. Okay, don't know if we got runners or not, but let's wake them up one at a time. Well, he definitely wasn't a runner. There we go. All right, one problem solved. Just got to be very careful now. All right, let's do this. That's not going to get our max health up, but if we can find some more cloth, we can get another bandage. These things give us leather. Not what we need. This does not even seem... I don't see a lot of guys here. Yeah, he's a runner. He was a runner. Don't see a lot of guys here. Well, we gotta make sure we get all our arrows back, as many as possible. Ah, oh, the stairs down over there. Open doorways. Ooh. Let's just waste you this way. Right through his head and into the post. Okay. Do uh, don't want to slide down there. Not without being ready, anyway. I don't like taking conventional ways down. Okay, we need to make sure there's nobody else on this floor. So, let's go. Quick roundabout. I don't think there is. Okay, looks pretty quiet. He says before he gets his ass handed to him. Uh. What? That sounded like somebody died. Uh, do we check up? Probably. Okay, that was the stairs we came in on. Landmine here, landmine there. Trying to keep you from going down the stairs. Okay, let's make a bandage. Get our max health up. 
Uh, class fragments, craft, craft another bandage after this. Just so we have it. I don't want to use a full bandage if we don't have to. Why is it doing that? going to give away my location. Okay, still pretty quiet. Oh, we got a radiated Mo down there. He should be fun. As long as we don't want to counter one in tight quarters. I was thinking about bringing some Molotovs, but I was thinking in close quarters like this it would probably be a bad idea. So I stayed away from them. Although it would have been nice just to toss stuff down. Okay, this was pretty quiet too. Let's go take out Radiated Mo first. The last thing you want is a Radiated Mo coming up from behind you. Hearing noises, but I don't know from where. Okay, there's another way. Well, this place is pretty big down here. That's cool. Just going to follow the lights, going to follow the doors as it was intended, I guess. Okay, we got a guy down there. Can we get a shot on him? I think we can. We can make a lot of stinking noise, too, at the same time. Where are they hitting? There they are. It only sounds like one though. I need to get my arrows. And they're gone already? Really? Where is he banging on though? Okay, where did you come out of? Oh, you just broke that down to get out of there. Somebody under the stick. Oh, for Christ's sake! What the hell are you banging on, man? Groin shot. Okay, we got guys back here now, too. Are they above us, or where are they? No, he's in here. Right there. Really? Oh, come on! Well, that's not good. Hey, guess what? I'm wet. Okay, I called bullshit on that hit.
Okay, can I... Why can't I not climb out of the water? Wow. Wow. That's all I gotta say to that. Okay. This is a difficult one. Now that's outside, it looks like. Okay, if I go along here, is this going to get us anywhere though? There's a door on that side. Come on. Here he comes. Die, Mo. Well, at least we found Mo. Are they under here? Sound very oh. They sound very angry, very angry indeed. Is that a cop? Sure is. Hey, big boy. Sucks to be big. Especially in tight quarters. You guys fell down there. Ooh, it's 322 bucks, guys. I'm rich. Uh. Kneecap that guy. And this guy. Okay, that guy's done. Ow! Broken leg. Where are they hitting? Sound like they're above me or below me? I don't think they're above me. Okay. 
Think I brought some frames. Okay, I think these rooms were the ones that those guys, other other guys, came out of. If I had to guess, it would surely be a guess. Yeah, there's a lot of guys in here. Good thing I found those <laughs> repair kits. Well, that helps. Man, they are angry. I just wish I knew they were. Getting some crazy lag. Okay, where did you come from? These guys are taking a beating, man. Where did they come from? Oh, up here. They're all above me. Okay. You guys do you. I'm going to do me. And hopefully I stay alive long enough to be able to get out of this place. Because I have no idea whereabouts we are right about now. Ooh. Loots. Where the fuck did you come from? Pardon my language. Now, he was walking, so let's get up here. Juicy. Eh. Wait, we got stone in here? Let's use this. They're really angry. Oh, is that another radiated Mo? Mo! That's really dumb. Mama, I'm over here. God, you are so stupid. But then again, you are a zombie, so... It's gonna stay up here. Reload. Actually, these are actually pretty good, uh... Little places to hide, almost. Alright, let's go out. They sound like they've broken down. Ooh, they're quiet. Almost. They sound like they've fallen down into here. Nope. So 
Somebody wants the guy went silent though. I can kind of hear him shuffling. Sorry if you guys can't hear that. I tried to turn it up a little bit. I didn't want it to be too loud. Alright. Really hoping she would just forget about me. Passing gas, working stiffs. We gotta break into that crate. Thought I heard him shuffling there for a second. Oh, we got a guy in here. They're up there. Oh, I do love those ones. Yeah, I hear shuffling. Don't know if that means they've already busted through. Or they've just forgotten about me. They certainly haven't forgot about me. Oh, you're up there. That's bulletproof glass, man. How can you see me through that? Popping pills. Eh. Wow. Oh, five repair kits. Alright, let's use one now. Get this thing fixed up. Listen to him. Dunk. Dunk. Come on, guys. Break through already. Ooh. Mostly useless garbage, but whatever. Anything in here? All right, let's scrap some stuff here. I'm gonna scrap these pistols. Uh, yeah, that's about it. Don't need the paper. That's uh, fine. That window has got like 2,500 health and he's still going on it. He's just mad I'm going to get away. Maybe I won't get away though. We got up and down here. Check those corners. No, we got just up. Oh yeah, that totally looks good, eh? That's the sucker's way out. Alright, we're going back through everybody. See if we can clear the rest of this building. They are really, really angry. Oh. This looks like a good tunnel to be in, eh? Totally confident about this one, guys. Yeah, they're coming this way. Come on, I'm right here. I hear you shuffling. Don't know if you guys can hear him. I can hear the... There, there you are. Oh. What do you got in here? Level 5 pistol? I'll take the oil. I'm gonna scrap the pistol though. Maybe I should have brought the Molotovs. You're up here. How do I get up there? Um, 
sure, whatever. All right, we're going to break this up. And we will uh, just scrap this for now. Yeah, let's make another bandage. Just so we have it. All right, let's get down here. Oh, God, they're so loud. When I get up there, you guys are in a lot of trouble. All right, we've already been through here. I'm gonna grab those two. Yep, let's make sure we're really loud. Gotta fix that, guys. Gotta fix that. This tank, man. This was a beautifully crazy trap, I gotta say. Good work, fun pimps. Oh, suitcase. Nothing. Oh, it's either a cop or a big boy. Oh, f screw you. Is it just me or they're trying to break through that door? All right, that's the room we were in there with the treasure in it. Let's take those. Okay, well, shut her up. It's Mo. Cuz why wouldn't it be Mo? What's up, buddy? Can you hold those for me, please? Okay, there's a few more doors here that we never did go through. So, I think they were through this door on the right. Now, I heard a cop. I don't know if that was Mo. Being oh, it went through both these doors. Sleeping on the job gets you killed. Ooh, I'll take the paint. It takes too long to make paint. Ah, more stuff to scrap. Those sledgehammers, though, I think they're worth, like, if you, if you melt them down, like 525 metal or something. So I've been melting them down. All right, this is the outs... Ooh. I don't like dogs. Not in this game. Okay, so yeah, this isn't as big as the uh, as Shotgun Messiah, but definitely fun. I gotta say, there's another one. I was a dummy and pulled the trigger while I was zooming. And one down here, too. A little better with the bow. Good thing those dogs are one-shottable with the bow. That'd be crazy coming out here and having three dogs on you. Thank you for holding that for me. Okay, so it looks like we got an upper... We go up first or we go in the door? Good question. They were doing a lot of beats down, beat downs down here. See if this door is open? Probably not. I bet you it's locked and we have to go in from above. Why do I even talk sometimes?
We having fun yet? I don't know why I took the feather. Uh, just in case we need wood. Let's scrap this. Okay, bookshelf. Alright, some stuff to sell. Eh, another bandage, maybe. Yeah, I gotta say, I was hoping for a little bit more from this POI. I mean, the loot wasn't bad. Don't get me wrong, I'm not complaining about the loot and stuff. But this is like, probably like a day 20, day 30 kind of run through. Um... If you know what you're doing, yeah, day 20, day 30 run through. You know, other than dogs, um, it's really just watching out for that water. Collapsing floors. The Shotgun Messiah, different, like it's just such a big wide open interior area that you have no idea where the zombies are going to be coming from, right? It's a thing you got to worry about. Alright. Now if water was a little bit more scarce in this game, like... It's not too bad to find water in this game, but if it was a little more scarce, then it would make having to go through this POI like essential to get water. Now I know they probably don't want to do that. Uh, let's just do this. Come on. They probably don't want to do that, but it would totally be worth it to like have to go into a place like this to find some water but then make sure the reward is good enough that you don't have to like constantly be coming back to get water you know all right let's get out of here of course there was no barbed wire there i still took damage because of course i did all right we'll just loot this stuff Ooh, acid nice that's good for military fiber and empty jar Less class we got to get. Um, was there anything over here? Nope. Yeah, what's this? All right, let's put some stuff in the bike. We'll have a look around and see what else is here. So that was like a half a day. Not bad. So we'll put all this stuff in here. Oh, let's get the bandage out. I think we'll hold up here for tonight. Uh, yeah. Just wondering what I should... Let's keep the duct tape out in case I have to make a, another stupid bandage. It's nice to come back with more arrows than you started with. Keep these out. Uh, we put our frames in there? No, we have our frames on us. Alright, we're on the bike. Let's have a look here. Uh, let's go for a drive around. I don't want to do the... Um, the the uh, hotel... Not the hotel, the apartment building. I've gone through with that before, not on, on camera, but it's just so tight, so in close. Now, I thought we had seen a city hall somewhere, but not in, maybe it's not here. It's in a different town, I think. Oh, yeah, it's in the desert town. What else do we got here we could hit up? That's another bunker. I mean, we could do that bunker, but it would be tougher now. Check out what's in the car here. Eh. Can make our own. So this is a bunker right here, right? The other thing too is I could take off up north and see if we can find ourselves another trader. We haven't got much farther north than this. Wait, what's this over here? That's the stadium. Oh. So the stadium, I mean, it's a big wide open area. It's not that difficult. But it should be fun because there's a lot of football players, I think, going to be in there. I got nothing against football players, but uh, these guys got to go down. We gotta find a place to stay too. I mean, we don't really. We just ride the bike back at nighttime. It's not a big deal. Um, or maybe we just continue through it. Ooh, don't wanna run into it. 
Run into that car. Where is the stadium? There it is. Some houses, apartments. See, that would have been a better church to start off in. Doesn't have a graveyard around it. You can just build a wall a lot closer. It's pretty much the same as the other one. I think this one is brick, though, all the way up. It's like concrete on the base and then brick all the way up with the big church sign on the front, just in case you didn't know what it was. All right, let's go um, get ourselves killed in the football stadium. That's an hour and a half before the uh, sun goes down. Zombies are running anyway. Maybe we just stay up here. Anything open? Oh. Okay, we got a radiated. There's a football player here. Let's see if we can take this guy out. Nice. Deal with that radiated last. Let's see what we can do with this football player here. We can get a nice headshot on him. Ooh. Okay, let's go take out the irradiated. Now we gotta watch out for these guys up here on the roof. First time I was in the football stadium, I never made it all the way through. I just did the kind of cleared the bottom floor. I was looking for clothing in the locker room, specifically a helmet. And uh, I got killed by guys coming down off there. Ice cream, real sushi, cold drinks, lockers, and hot dogs. Nice. Let's go to the hot dog stand after this. Get ourselves a nice hot dog. Wow, I thought I didn't think these guys would go down with one shot. But I guess if they're not feral, I mean, the football players always run. But I guess if they're not feral, they only got... A certain amount of hit points. All right, locker room's going to give us problems, I think. We're reloaded, right? Yeah. Okay, I think everybody up there is dead. Oh, great, it's locked. Um, okay. Well, that's that problem solved. I'm here in sleepers. Where they are is a good question. See, this would be like on a day one, if you came into the main floor here, pulled up on here, and just stayed up there for the whole night. It's the toilets. You'd be fine, I think. But with radiate, it's a little different story. Must be nuclear poo in here. Okay. Going to head down to the other side now. Actually, we'll see if we can see anything in these places here. We could just wake them up. I want some coins, though. That's what I'm here for. Okay, don't see anybody there. So it doesn't mean there's nobody there, though. No money in these tills either, eh? Okay, it's all quiet. Yeah, it's not as um, bad as I thought it was going to be. Let's get our light on now. I think there's a lumberjack outside. There's a lot of, like, there's grandstands above us, too, so we'll probably find some guys up in the grandstands. Then there's like a little booth up top. Okay, it's quiet. As far as I can tell. I 
I think he's outside. Probably up there. Okay, that's locked. There's the night time. Going to go a little longer here. Handle this stadium. Handle with care. See if we can make it through the night with this one. Alright, here we go. Clear rooms are always good. Nice. All right. <laughs> this locker room now. <laughs> I got a feeling there's a lot of guys in here. Okay, I think he's outside. Because these sleepers wouldn't be making that noise. If he heard me, he'd be running in here. Wow. Nothing. Alright, let's go outside. That lumberjack, though. Hear him? Alright, let's find out. We never did check these tills, did we? Yeah, nothing here. What a ripoff. Okay, he's... I think he hears me. If he doesn't, he's about to see me here. Now, we could have sleepers in the field here, too, so I have to watch out for guys coming from behind us. I'm going to have problems with uh, heating and cooling. There's one lumberjack. There's someone sleeping there. There's the other one. Okay, he doesn't see me yet because he'd be running after me if he saw me. He says as the lumberjack begins to run after him. And football player. He's still alive. Let's get this guy on us. Okay. We steal arrows in this compound bow at range. That guy doesn't stand too much of a chance. I don't see anybody lying in the field here. I thought there was somebody here, but it's just garbage. So we're going to go up here in the stands. I'm sure there's lots of guys up there. I'd be interested to see what this... Th oh, another lumberjack. Right there. Can't see him through the fence, but he's there. Let's get him. Otherwise, he's going to hear us here. Don't you walk away from me when we got a fight going on. Yeah, I've stopped with the bow trying to uh, aim for anything but center mass. If you can get them while they're still, great. Or if they're moving slowly, great. But if other than that, just center mass. Okay, we got to radiate it down there. It's all quiet. We got one up here too, I think. That's one. Nope. Huh, thought there would have been a lot more in the stands here. I'm sure we'll find some more though. I bet you that thing's full of them. There's like a roof up there. So I watched Glock 9. He's starting a new series now. Um, that's weird to have one of those there. Uh, he's starting a new series, which is his um, 
uh, Horde Every Night series, and he's starting off in a uh, stadium. Come on. Okay, no arrows. Got a guy down here. Now, I don't see anybody. Oh, that's the entrance way. Right, okay. It's quiet up here still. Quieter the better. Okay, we should be able to kill her with one shot. Anybody on the stairs? Nope. Let's try and take her out with one shot. Okay, nice. Make our way up the stairs here. Okay, I don't see anybody over there. Oh, we got someone up here. I think we can shoot through this fence. Sure so can. Chain link fence, baby. Chain link fence for the win. Whoa, we got another guy. They're not messing around. I don't know if he's feral or not. He may not be feral, but he sure as hell is stupid. Okay, we got a crawler. Oops, we got a dead guy. <laughs> uh, see, this is kind of cool. You could turn this whole thing into a fort up here. Like, it's pretty neat. Yeah, we definitely need the brass. Um, like... You could just, like, knock the stairs out, elevate this a little bit, you know, have a wall here, and just stay up high. And this is kind of cool here. It's got a little fort. Things you can kind of see down, and I don't know, I think it would be kind of neat. So I'm interested to see what he does with the series, Glock 9. If you haven't checked out his videos, I suggest you go check him out. He's a really good player. He's actually the reason why I got into playing 7 Days to Die. Anybody under here? Doesn't look like it. Of course the door is locked, because why wouldn't it be? Choke point! Of course. Uh, not too bad. I mean, we took damage, but still. At least we got him caught in the choke point. I really wasn't sure if they were going to hear that, smashing the door open, but kind of glad we got them all in one shot. Should probably be picking these up. Never did pick them up at the other place. They're great to wrench apart for mechanical parts. And powder. Jesus, I saw, I saw this and I'm like, oh shit, there's another guy here. I bet you there's somebody up on the roof. Find out. And nope. That's kind of good, I guess. So this is all wood up here. But all this other stuff is concrete, so I mean... You can fix this up without a problem. You don't need much to fix all this whole place up here. Okay, we got fall off of here. So we don't have very many days left until the horde shows up. Snoring gets you killed. Actually, I shouldn't be saying that because I snore horribly. That's why I got a CPAP. I'm surprised my wife didn't hasn't choked me in my sleep by now. Although I'm sure she's thought about it several times. Alright, well, that's it for this place. Not as hard as I thought it was going to be, but not bad. So I'm going to end the episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, a couple of more POIs. If I can find... I want to find... Um, 
there was the uh, what's it called um, City Hall I think I want to try and clear that uh, it won't be the today or the next day well we got to get home we got to dump all this stuff off from the bike might be able to do it tomorrow um, I'm talking about game episodes um, we might be able to do it I don't know we got a couple of days before the horde arrives so day 58 we're on 58 now so we might be able to do it today 59 and then sick all day 60 is still um, still viable too so we really have three days three full days before the horse shows up at night a lot of duct tape man I may just made a bunch of duct tape I was like oh, I really don't want to make duct tape but then I had to make it just to make med kits but whatever all right guys I'm in the episode here I hope you enjoyed it I'm gonna make my way back home uh, dump everything off in the bike and then we'll take off the next day and go down I think and hit up the um, the uh, city hall in the uh, desert the de it's actually I think it's in the wasteland biome I think just south of us uh, so we'll go down there and check that out and I might spend the next day I don't know before the horde uh, cruising around to try and find another trader on the map I don't know but I think I might end this series on day 60 uh, and then, like, that'll kind of be roughly the official end. Although, this is a nuclear bunker here we could do, too. Missile silo. This is a dangerous place, too, right? He says, seeking out danger. Um, that's another option. Um, but, yeah, and then what I'll do, probably, like, I'll end the series there on the Day 60 Horde. However we do, we do. Uh, and then what I'll end up doing is... Um, I'll probably still play the series um, just in my spare time and then you know whenever I hit up a major POI I'll just record it and tack it on to the end of the series uh, just upload it when I have a chance to and I'll just do POIs after this because at a certain point in this game I, I don't want to say you're invincible you're not really because you can always die relatively easily um, really the only thing you got to worry about is the horde and then you just run away if you if you have a problem you can just run away or hop on your motorbike and leave them around all night just carry some extra gas with you and you know you're done you don't have to worry about them then once they stop uh once the morning comes you just turn around and you know oh we got to cash our quest in tomorrow too um you just turn around and uh you know get off your bike and finish them off on foot but uh you know that's something that Glock 9 is really good good at. If you go check his videos out, he's really good at fighting the Horde on foot at night when they're all running. I, I can't do that. That would just be the end of me. That would be the end of me and the end of this series. But yeah. Alright, so I'm ending it here. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And you can drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.